Hey guys, it's me, Alicia, and I've been listening to all of you guys' complaints. You guys want to see some more affordable units, so I got one for you. This one actually comes from lwigs.com. I'll be sure to leave all the information down below. Here are a few things that comes along, your packaging and whatnot for Lwigs. And this is the unit that I did pick up. This is their 100% human hair U-part lace front wig. As you guys can see, it just has that U-gap in the front with a pre-tweezed hairline. And of course, you're going to have your combs in the interior and your adjustable straps in the back. And the texture that I did get is their silky. So I'm going to show you guys how I get all of this hair inside of the wig. Because <laughs> you guys know I do not braid my hair down like French braids and stuff. I just do two ponytails and I always use a black stocking cap. I don't know, I don't like the way the light nude tone ones look. It looks really noticeable, so I like to go with black. And yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and get that lace cut off. And this is the way the hair is looking like, okay? So you do get that little gap in the middle. You can adjust your wig to get like a different side part. But for the most part, it is a center part wig. They might have some other options on the website. You will have to check it out. But this is the way the hair looks like on me. Now, with the, the uh, wig that I did get, I do believe this is their 20-inch and 200% density. It doesn't really feel like a 200%. It feels more like, I would say, like a 150 to 180. But needless to say, it is very full. Unlike other companies that I've had recently, this one is actually pretty full. So I do appreciate that from them. The hair is also very soft. I got a minimum amount of shedding. Nothing too much to complain about. But yeah, I'll let you guys know how it holds up um, once I start wearing it a lot more. But what I don't like about this wig is the very center is this hump. And I do believe it's from the combs that is around the U part gap. So I do recommend you guys taking those out. I wanted to do a video showing you guys how I take them out and whatnot and how it looks. But the company was just rushing me. They were like, no, 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 we want your video right now, today. So I couldn't do it, okay? So, um, yeah, this is what I have for you guys, okay? But um, now I'm just um, wanting to get the hair to look um, really pretty and not have that packaged hair bumps and stuff like that. And needless to say, it is very nice, okay? So I recently got another wig from another company that was like the same texture, and this texture does beat it out, okay? So I do prefer this one better than the other silky that I did get from another company, all right? But now I'm going to focus on that parting space. I do recommend you guys plucking it because it looks very manufactured, and my parting space wasn't that great looking. Um... So yeah, again, you guys, make sure you guys do tweeze it to make it look a lot natural and just, you know, because mine's was looking like part weird and then part straight. I don't know, you guys, but needless to say, with the price of this unit, you guys can do what you have to do to make it look the way you want it to look. I do believe this hair is like a hundred and something bucks, and again, this is like a 20 inch, 200% um, density, and um, yeah, 100% Indian Remy human hair. You can curl it. I did notice that it did hold a curl pretty well. And it's very, very, very soft. And this is where it falls on me. And I am five foot eight, and I do have a long torso. Okay. So, anyways, you guys, again, this does come from lwigs.com. I'll be sure to leave all the information down below for you guys. Shipping for this company, I think it didn't take me that long. I would say within a week, I got the hair. All right. Um, be sure to check down below to see um, if I run into any issues with the hair. And let me know what you guys think. And I'll catch you guys later. Bye, guys.